sleep more to weigh less. Being short on sleep can really affect your weight. The association between short sleep and obesity is well established. Sleeping less means you are eating more and you put on weight. The present study focuses on the association between sleep and obesity and is the first to uncover its link to increased eating and drinking. Dr. Gabriel S. Tejer, an epidemiologist of the University of Alabama, and colleagues conducted an interesting study. They collected the data from 28,150 American adults, aged 21 to 65 years, from 2006 to 2008, of whom 55.8% were female. The study was published in the American Journal of Health Promotion. The study found, short sleepers engage in secondary eating and drinking. Secondary eating and drinking means eating or drinking beverages other than water, such as sugar-sweetened beverages. While primarily engaged in another activity, such as watching television. Seven hours sleep a night, is considered to be normal, for an adult. People who lack sleep are more likely to eat while doing activities like watching TV. Short sleep is associated with more time spent in secondary eating and drinking. Short sleep increases the caloric intake in the form of sugar-sweetened beverages. Not enough sleep is linked to distracted eating and drinking, resulting in obesity. Skipping night sleep sets your brain to make bad decisions. It dulls the brain's frontal lobe activity, the locus of decision-making and impulse control. It's little like being drunk. You don't have the mental clarity to make good decisions. Sleep is like nutrition for the brain. When sleep is deprived, body makes more ghrelin, the hunger hormone. Same time, leptin, from brain drops, signaling the body to eat more food. No wonder sleep deprivation leads to overeating and extra pounds. Lack of sleep for two weeks, disrupt insulin levels and derange the metabolism to affect the body weight, and impair long-term health. Healthy adults who sleep less than 6.5 hours, have shown that the body's ability to process glucose in the blood declines, in some cases even to the level of diabetes. For these people to normalize their blood sugar levels, they need to make 30% more insulin in the body than normal sleepers. The cortisol spike also comes from too little sleep. This stress hormone signals the body to conserve energy to fuel your waking hours and to put on fat. When sleep is inadequate for two weeks, the amount of weight lost from fat dropped by 55%, even though the calories remained same. Getting enough sleep is as important as diet and exercise to health, well-being, and your weight. Thanks for watching. Please click the link in description for more information.